Good morning. Sorry I haven't been updating you guys in a while, but it has been crazy. Uh, it's the end of the school year. We got graduations, proms, all of the things um, going on. And I have just been crazy, crazy busy. Most mornings I'm on the phone. But anyway, y'all don't care about that. Y'all want to hear about my update with my fitness journey. That's why you came. So we are on uh, round one, week seven, day five of my E2M journey. As of this morning, the uh, lion as ho had me at 150 pounds. So I have officially, technically hit my goal. And I still have a week and a couple of days left. So I am very, very excited. I've had a couple of, well, more than a couple of non-scale victories, NSVs as we call them. Um, Yesterday, I got two sorors that are going to be signing up for the next round. So that is always impressive that they're seeing the results, they're seeing what's happening, and they too want to join uh, the E2M. So that's huge. Um, other victories for me, I had, I'm, I'm back in my skinny jeans. I think I said that to you guys already. Um, I was able to wear my, um, victory dress already um so i was able to fit into that i have to buy all new underwear all new bras talk about a great problem to have i'm excited my husband was like oh you're gonna have to buy new clothes for the summer and i was like yes credit card please <laughs> um so that's huge a lot of my underwear are falling down like they can't fit me at all um what else do I have to tell you guys? Oh, my my health. I know the last time we were talking about my blood tests and blood work and all that stuff. So they redid um, some of my blood work. The liver and kidney um, numbers are back to normal. So maybe it was just a fluctuating thing um, with my system and, and, and getting healthy. So that's good. Um, I'm cut constantly going to my new chiropractor I like him a lot I think the other chiropractor just was hurting me more than helping me so I absolutely like my new chiro chiropractor um what else what else what else what else what else from this e2m journey um this week this the last two weeks as far as the food is concerned is rough because I am on the fast track I'm not taking no, so there's like no snacking, there's there's no fun stuff, um, it's a lot of raw spinach, um, which, okay, <laughs> not the greatest, but okay, um, and asparagus, which I am not a fan of, um, so what I did is I kind of meal prepped the asparagus to be the beginning of the week um mixed it in the middle of the week with some um like grilled string beans with like garlic and 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 olive oil um but then this morning as I'm packing up my lunch I was like oh, I got some asparagus left <sighs> Whew. asparagus is really really good for you but oh my gosh, it is so stinky and it makes makes your pee stink, makes your fart stink. Like it just makes everything stink. Um, so ew, but trucking along man and just getting ready to figure out what maintenance is gonna look like for me. So if I keep doing this next week and a half fingers crossed that I fall below my goal of 150 and now I will have to try to maintain um until summer and until my birthday and until forever and if there is another round between now and my birthday I'll probably do it again um, and just do the steady track, right? Um, because 
I, I don't I don't want to be unhealthy anymore I there are you know lots of food modifications that I'm okay with and I want to stay okay with my current food modifications I know once we go into maintenance that they teach us which carbs we can have so I'm looking forward um, to that and I can't wait to see what um, you know what carbs we can get with healthy um, snacks and stuff but I don't think I want to go back to all of the fatty fatty sugary sugary I like where I'm at I like I like the feedback that I'm getting I like the <gasps> shocked faces from fr friends and family I almost have my cousin and if she's watching I hope she she's listening to me and that she's gonna do it because this this is great and I keep looking at old pictures from like the start of COVID and how fat my face was like I had no idea until like I'm looking at those memories that come up and I'm just like like I knew I was getting big but to see the difference from then and now oh whew. so again if you needed a reason to get healthy this is a sign sign up for the next round of e2m i promise you your body your mind your spirit your family will thank you for getting healthy okay okay thanks i'll talk to you guys well it's friday so i'll talk to y'all come monday when we get into week eight final week we almost there okay have a great day bye